Welcome to the Android Proxy Server app. In this video, I will show you how to use the application to create a proxy server and share your mobile VPN and Tor proxy. Click on the plus button to create a new proxy instance. You can choose what type of proxy server you want to create. There are three different proxy servers available. SOX5 slash SOX4, HTTP slash HTTPS or TCP Relay. Fill out the instance details like name, host, and port. I am going to give a username and password for this SOX proxy server. Click on the Done button to create the proxy server instance. I am going to launch the proxy server instance, this will listen on port 1080. Now I am going to set up the SOX5 proxy server on my computer browser, which is connected to the same network as my phone. Once it connected, you can monitor how much data has been sent or received from the proxy server instance. You can also see the log to see where these requests are been sent. Let's turn off this proxy server and I will show you how to set up a TCP relay with Tor proxy. Let's switch to no proxy in the browser and I am going to show you my current location, because I want to show you when we connect to the Tor network through TCP relay, my location will be changed. Open the Orbit and start the Orbit service, Orbit SOX 5 proxy will run on port 9050. Now I am going to create a new proxy server instance, I will give the name of this instance as Tor Proxy Sharing. Select the proxy type as TCP Relay. This instance will run on port 1081. For the TCP Relay host 127.0.0.1 and for the port 9050 because Orbit Sox 5 proxy is running on this address and port. Now let's turn on this proxy server instance and set that to our browser. Let's check our location now. Alright, now I will show you how to share your mobile VPN with other devices on the same network. Switch back to our previous proxy server instance. Note that you can run multiple instances at the same time. Once you connected to the proxy you can open and connect to your VPN app as usual on your phone. Now all the requests coming to the proxy server instance will go through the VPN.